Hello everyone, welcome back again. So in the continuation of our vocabulary series, today is the day 17 and you know very well vocab is a way to improve our communication. So let's see what are the words for the day 17 with us. So there are two very interesting as well as nice words. Then if you are going to apply these words in your vocabulary in your day to day communication, then definitely your communication is going to be very much impressive. So let's see what are the words for the day 17 with us. So the very first word that is I'm going to um, I'm going to pronounce it for you as well as this word is quite favorite of mine. So let's see. G R A T I T U D E and the pronunciation is gratitude, right? So means uh, we can say that this word is very very much beautiful as well as a very positive word and I would advise each and every one out there please do use these words in your day to day life. So the meaning of this beautiful word gratitude is the quality of being thankful, right? Means you are very much thankful to your this human being life, right? You are very much thankful to each and every positive things around you. You are very much thankful to the Almighty that you receive a sound health a sound body as well as a good mind you are very much uh, feeling very much grateful to other person who are helping out you continuously at your hard times right so means to say that you have to be very much thankful for each and everything that makes you right so the quality of being thankful every time as well as the meaning is that readiness to show appreciation for and to return kindness. If a person is kind to you, if the situation is kind to you, always appreciate the person as well as the situation and try that in reward back you are going to pass the same kindness, right? So this is the meaning of gratitude. For example, she expressed her gratitude to the committee for their support. There is an individual person who is expressing her immense great gratitude, immense thankfulness to the committee who helped him, sorry, who helped her out, right? So this is the meaning of gratitude. Let's move to the another word, H-O-A-X and the pronunciation is hoax, right? It means a humorous deception, a kind of joke or a prank means to say that a kind of false information that is used uh, for a fun kind of behavior. Alright, for example, traffic was disrupted by a hoax bomb. Means to say that, that there was a traffic jam all over the road, uh, road just because of a wrong information that has been floated and the intention behind that information is to make fun or a kind of prank. So hoax means there is information that a bomb is there. So that is why the whole traffic of the road was disrupted. Right. So hoax means a kind of uh, false statement or a kind of false deception, a kind of uh, prank that has been floated by any other individual. So this is the intention behind uh, uh, floating some message uh, if this is, if that is the prank as well as a joke. So we can consider that information as a hoax information that is a false information. All right. So these are the words for the day 17. I hope you people like it. And I would advise each and every one out there if you wanted to improve your communication, please enhance your vocabulary, use good words as well as try to understand these words. But the application is very much important. So that's all for today. This is for day 17. I hope you people like it. So please stay tuned for the rest of the 365 days. Thank you so much for listening. Happy learning.